In this lesson, we'll explore the unique ID property in Notion databases and explain how unique IDs are useful for project management. As you move throughout your work, unique IDs can help to more efficiently and accurately track tasks and reduce duplicate entries. What's more, if your team is working with issues in GitHub, you'll be able to use these unique IDs to sync status updates too, but more on that soon. When you add a unique ID property, you'll be able to assign a custom prefix and Notion will do the rest. Note that a database can only have one unique ID property and that once an ID is used, even if that row is deleted, it won't be used again. This is to ensure accuracy and consistency. Use ID properties to ensure that there is no overlap in task assignments that might have the same name, quickly find a database item in a workspace, and so much more. Let's see how this works in practice. In our Acme workspace, we'll find that unique ID is already enabled on our engineering task board, since it's a default property in the projects, tasks, and sprints template. In this marketing tasks board, however, it is not. Not to worry, just like any other property, we can add unique ID to this database by adding a column and selecting ID. Here, we'll assign the prefix M, A, R, and that's it. Within seconds, all of our existing tasks will be given a unique identifier, which we can use to enhance communication across our teams. In the next lesson, we'll get into how you can use unique IDs in Notion to keep your tasks up to date with GitHub. Make sure you have this property set up before moving on. See you soon. Bye.